let's go. to the airbnb and i'm gonna do a little apartment tour because it's just amazing like the view is so pretty so here is the entry and here we have the living room so pretty and this is the kitchen and it's so cute we have like little snacks and there's glass all over the building so this is it then the main thing is the living room like the floor are eating are you comfy so look at the view, like it's so unbelievable, like whoa, it's pretty cold outside but whoa, just for the view, so worth it and we are on the 37th floor, so pretty! Okay, now let's go to the bathroom, okay, so this is the bathroom, very clean and yeah, we love it and then we have the bedroom so this is supposed to be a window so look at the view from the bedroom and here is another window with a view So we just did the consultation with the doctor, he was amazing. So he drew on my face like, like he's supposed to. And um, he asked me if I had a broken nose, which I don't have. So maybe it's from birth. Um, and also he told me that I had a lot of allergies uh, because he watched inside my nose. So I have to treat that. And also he told me that he was gonna shorten my nose, fix the tip, the droopy tip. And I showed him example of what I like because I was scared that it wasn't gonna change my face at all. So I showed him and he told me that uh, it could be possible to do something similar. Like the results are gonna be similar to what I want. So I'm so happy. <laughs> the laser hurts so bad oh my god it's awful it's the worst thing i've ever done <laughs> to myself so cute it's just near the hospital i look so crazy like whoa so we just finished and we are gonna get sushi really really cute we make it to the sushi it's so cute but i look like nothing <laughs> So we just came back to this view, so pretty and look at the bedroom, insane. I wish it was my bedroom, <laughs> so pretty and I look like this. So I can't take any pictures, no pictures for me, I'm awful. Tomorrow morning is the surgery, so I don't stress. Not now, but I know tomorrow morning is gonna be like awful. I don't know if I can take a medication for the stress because I do, uh, I have panic attacks. So I don't know, but I will see. And because it's early in the morning, I have to be there at 7. So we leave the apartment at 6.30. So hopefully I'm gonna be like zoned out like I'm gonna be so tired that I'm not gonna stress <laughs> right now I'm just enjoying the view like the sun is setting down and it's so pretty but it's so calming and uh, I'm so happy we chose this Airbnb like really we had to stay for two weeks and it was the best deal for the price we paid we would have had a shitty hotel maybe not a shitty hotel but not as good as this one so we're pretty we're pretty excited about that okay so i'm going to sleep i put some i don't know how you say it like pomade on my face and it was like it felt like sand like it's awful and now i have to put this in my nose in my nose and they will take it off rinse it tomorrow so the instructions are in turk turkish so gonna try to figure it out so inside the nose it feels really weird 
this is not okay to post like well i think it's gonna get worse so why not okay how do you not make a mess? Okay. I think it's okay. So I'm gonna sleep now and see you tomorrow. So morning of the surgery. He can drink and I can. I think this is the worst. I'm so thirsty. I stopped drinking at midnight and I woke up like very dehydrated. I feel like this is gonna be the hardest because after surgery you have to wait six hours before drinking so i don't know how i'm gonna make it so we're in the taxi and look at this like it's so pretty all the lights and i'm not uh, stressing out yet so i'm so ashamed because like when i watch uh, videos on um on youtube like how the surgery goes and everything and you know when they put you the thing in your hands like everybody is fine like they are standing up and everything and me i'm like having a panic attack so the lady came in and she took my blood pressure uh from them i started shaking a little bit and then she puts like three needles in me like in my hand first then in my arm where they took your blood pressure you know and then in my hand, it was so difficult for me, like I was shaking, <laughs> awful, but it's more stress than pain, so it's okay. He's so fed up with me, but it's all good, but now I'm not gonna move, I'm gonna lay down and sleep, honestly. Two hours later. I look so crazy. I just got the lunch. I stopped shaking from the anesthesia so I feel okay. They changed the patch on the nose and now I can eat but I'm gonna try. <laughs> I'm not very hungry. This is what I have. I'm vegan so I'm not gonna take the thing with the milk in it. I'm gonna try this and the rice. I took two bites and oh my god <laughs> and I just caught like i do not agree at all so annoying and i feel so tired like i just want to sleep but i don't know if i have to eat like oh, my eyes are so heavy uh i don't want to eat so i don't know what to do and i tried to to took a sneak peek and it looks good like i'm so excited so it's so worth it so far but really challenging by those keep make it sound we can see that it's so much smaller such a angel it helped me so much if you ever want to do this in a foreign country like here istanbul don't come alone because if it goes somewhere like you're gonna struggle i'm very not strong so like every video i saw on youtube everyone seems so uh, cool and like it's nothing it's not <laughs> if my nose is messed up i'm not gonna do another rhinoplasty i'm gonna i'm gonna accept it because all my complaints were changed so it's okay i look like a grandma in that gown guys i passed out because i did but eat lunch, I eat uh, like a uh, three, four spoon. So now I have to eat the beets, the rice, the bread, <sighs> or I won't feel good and I will pass out again. So yeah. Back to the hotel, I change, just put on a t-shirt very carefully. My boyfriend helped me and jogging. Sorry for the bed. It's messy. And I put a little bend in my hair because they're disgusting. Look at that. My god, they are so messed up. But I'm just gonna rest and uh, I don't think there's a lot to update from now on. Well, for the day one, I don't feel like I have a lot of bruises or anything. So yeah, I will update if I have something, but just right now I'm so tired okay so yeah and i always try to take a peek at what i might look like but uh, it's so difficult and i'm supposed to breathe but uh because there's blood running down my nose it's stuffy so it's complicated to breathe from the nose but i'm able to because they took out the cotton thing <laughs> Guys, 
guys, I had the realization that I did not do a good job of explaining what I was going through and how having a nose job was like. So I really suck at documenting. You're not gonna learn a lot from watching my video, but uh, I hope it's okay. <laughs> I'm gonna try to explain. But I, I did not document it on the spot, so yeah. It's kind of hard to like to document everything when you're in pain because I was in pain. It's been uh, seven days and I've only been out once. Not feeling good, so I couldn't go out. Uh, tomorrow we're gonna try to go uh, to explore a little bit I'm gonna, and I'm gonna record that. But before, I couldn't do it, so yeah. I really wanted to do a video and document my experience because I've watched a lot of vlogs before doing the surgery and it helped me a lot but no matter the amount of videos you watch you're not gonna be prepared to what your body is going through because I saw some people struggling but uh, it's another thing going through it but I really suck at that so well at least I tried but yeah <laughs> What, you want everything there? J'ai trop peur. Ah! Attends, je fais la traite. Attends. J'ai trop trop peur. Tu regardes avant moi? Si tu veux. Tu vois? Wait a minute! Who are you? What? Oh mon dieu, il est tout gonflé! C'est trop bizarre! Oh mon dieu! Putain, mais. En plus, je suis hyper gonflé. Mais il est hyper gonflé! Mais il est tout petit! What? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would. Oh wow, I feel like a Oh mon dieu. Ça fait trop bizarre. Mais il est énorme. Parce qu'il est gonflé, c'est normal. Ah, profil, et comment je sors Profil, c'est bien. Ça choque moins, je veux dire, de te voir de profil que de face. <rire> Là, je reconnais tellement pas. Oh mon dieu! Je m'attendais pas à ce qu'il soit perturbant comme ça. Oh, je suis choquée! Oh my god, I just took the cast off and it's so weird. Like, who is she? It looks so fake because I'm still very, very swollen here and I look very crusty. I have to go to the bathroom and look how swollen it is. Like, the tip is massive and when I speak like my top lip don't move so I look it looks very fake but I know the swelling gonna go down <laughs> guys I can't take myself seriously <laughs> it's so weird I have to take a shower to rinse everything off and it looks like a triangle like it's huge and look from the side it looks like this So yeah, I like it. I know it's gonna go down, so I feel like it's gonna be very cute, but I don't know how much it's gonna take to <laughs> for the swelling to go down. I have to do this because my stitches are on the side and I can't smile. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the shower, I'm gonna rinse it. Oh my god, and I will adapt you when I'm to the hospital so you can take everything off my nose. Oh, from certain angle is so weird, like here, it's huge. And from here, it's cute. Huge. Cute. So I cleaned it a little bit. And she's looking cuter. We love. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I'm still very swollen, like on the lips and everything. From the front, it's a mess, obviously. But from here, it's a mess. 
but from the side like here it's okay it's cute but yeah so i cleaned it a little bit and i was supposed to remove the casts only one hour before going to the hospital but uh, i did it way earlier because my cast was already very lifting up and i wanted to see so i removed it like three four hours before uh, it's not gonna change a lot of things so that's why i took it off like the cast was very bothering me he was it was moving and everything and i was so excited to see so yeah already getting used to it obviously that's really not my face and it was the goal i didn't want to keep my old nose structure i really wanted a tinier nose and a smaller nose to soften my features so that's what i did because i could have kept my nose and just lift the tip and keep it straight and very pronounced but no i wanted a smaller nose and i'm obsessed like I feel, I feel like it's gonna be so cute already from this side i love it from the front uh, it's gonna get better and from the side it's complicated to see from the side but it looks good so yeah so excited to get the things removed and to start being used to my nose and see the swelling go down it's gonna take a lot of time i think it's gonna take two weeks to look less ridiculous than this and after it's gonna take three months to be more decent and some days it's gonna be big some days it's gonna be smaller so yeah one year to be way more natural and also uh, my top lip is still very swollen so it looks very fake because when i smile and everything this is not like what is this i look crazy okay so now we're going to the appointment <laughs> oh c'est incroyable can't believe it from the front is still awful <laughs> but this view is good two hours later okay um i have an update to do uh on the appointment like i'm so mad at myself <laughs> but i was like not feeling comfortable filming the nurse and everything uh, that took the thing inside my nose so they just removed the thing inside my nose they cleaned my nose and they took some pictures where i looked so swollen like i looked horrifying so i don't think they're gonna use my pictures because i'm awful now it's been three days since I removed my cast and I came back home so it's a little less swollen oh also I did laser again on the nose so that's why like it's so crusty I wanted to do the old face but they started doing the nose and it hurt so bad like guys I'm not even joking worse than the first time and the first time was awful so you can't imagine the pain so yeah and look at how close from the eyes it was i died <laughs> so yeah so this is how it's looking i just wanted to do an outro and update you so it's still very swollen don't get me wrong especially the tip but i feel like it's better than on the cast removal so just so you get an idea of what it looks like now so yeah don't forget to let me know in the comments where if you want an update i think i'm gonna do an update video uh, maybe in three months or five like when it's way smaller than this if it went down because like this i'm looking like a mess i don't think it's very beneficial to stop at this stage but um I'm gonna edit the video, I'm gonna upload it, and maybe it's gonna get zero views, so I won't do an update. But if you guys are curious, let me know, and I definitely would do an update, so yeah.